specifically at UMKC in our professional education, our IPE, our, our School of Medicine, School of Pharmacy, School of Dentistry, and School of Nursing and Health Studies students coming together in activities to learn uh, how to take care of patients together. Professional education just really offers students, including myself, a, a really uh, rich experience with connecting with one another mm -hmm. in a circumstance that we wouldn't have otherwise. These kinds of experiences are project-based, they deal with real situations, they help promote students thinking about engaging in more service learning, then it helps them to collaborate together. The idea behind interprofessional education is that if our students learn in silos and they're expected on day one in practice to begin working together as teams, we haven't really done our job in a curriculum. We can create individual practitioners, but um, in healthcare, in our environment today in healthcare, it takes an entire team to create positive patient outcomes. We found that the poverty simulation, which is created by the Missouri Community Action Network, was a great opportunity for us to capture what we've been missing in our other activities. They have to walk a month in the shoes of someone in poverty so that they can learn that empathy and learn very specifically about the problems that our patients face. I think this simulation really helps to show that you know families in poverty and communities in poverty have different needs than what we might think that they need. We always try to give the best health care from what we think is the best health care for a patient. And I think that this simulation really shows us that that's not always their first priority. I think it's a great opportunity because in the health field, a lot of people, we have those set roles. Pharmacists are better at dealing with the drugs, the social work, you know, we usually pass off the social concerns to them. And I think this taught us to learn how to think outside of our normal boxes and learn how to work with each other. The biggest takeaway that I have is it really is hard to, you know, if you're at a disadvantage already in a situation of poverty, it really is hard to come up from that and really is hard to make ends meet and um, it really is hard for people just to find the basic necessities of life and we're healthcare students trying to promote healthcare to, to patients that might not necessarily prioritize it and we need to work with them and recommend resources and just kind of facilitate them to become a better person overall. Everybody brings different skills and knowledge to the table uh, and so giving them opportunities to work together learn from each other, helps them figure out how they can work together to uh, improve patient care outcomes in the end of the day. If what we do at UMKC is to help our healthcare professionals um, in the future uh, think as they do their work about the humanness of the people they're working with, um, both their peers as well as their patients, I think we will make a really significant contribution.